Well, we're coming up on the KOA Sugarloaf Key. There it is over there to the left. Beautiful, beautiful place. Uh, we're staying, stayed here for five nights. It's uh, almost practically brand new. It hasn't even been open a year yet, I don't think, after the, they rebuilt it. They're building even suites around it, uh, so if you don't have a camper, you can still stay here. They do boat rentals, uh, jet skis, I mean, kayaks, you name it, they got it here on the water. When you're coming down A1A, if, uh, of course, you'll be looking at everything. As soon as you come to the sign that says Sugarloaf Key, right here on the uh, A1A, then you'll be, the next uh, road to your left is Highway, uh, I have to look up here, it's Highway 2637 or something like that, but it's straight across from Mango Mama's uh, right there on the right. Nice place to eat. Uh, had some really good food there the other night. But uh, Sugarloaf Key right there is a sign on it. As soon as you get across the little bridge right there, go across there, you start looking to your left and you'll see the uh, entrance to the road up here. It doesn't have a sign right at the end of it. I don't know if they don't allow them here or not but, uh, for a campground, but uh, it's pretty easy to hit. And when you're going down that road, uh, it's not very far. It's a couple hundred feet down through here, and uh, you'll see the big giant entrance and just pull in there to check in. And then you come out a little bit on further down there when you exit it. Come in and out the same road because it dead ends back in there. And to a few uh, really nice homes back in there, Gaty. But it's a really nice, nice, nice place to be. I'm telling you, it's uh, beautiful here. It's been a little warm. It's been in the hundreds. Uh, I guess that's probably typical for June. State Road 939B. 939B. And you just turn left right into it. You follow the main road trees around through here. And it kind of straightens out when you get down here. Of course, they have got construction vehicles down here right now where they're building all them suites surrounded. And uh, you'll see the big yellow and orange sign, of course, down here on the left. Uh, go into it. Beautiful park. Uh, our campsite is right on the water, so it was outstanding. Uh, most of them in here has got stone pavers where you sit at. They furnish your picnic tables and chairs. And we, we got some of ours out just so we can move them around in the shade and spots too when we wanted to sit underneath the palm tree and read. But it was awesome. Uh, I couldn't say too many more good things about it. Bath houses are spotless. Uh, beautiful uh, pool huge pool and a, a bar right beside of it uh, you can order uh, snacks they got a restaurant behind it a little small grocery store in there if you ran out of something you swing by there and get it it was awesome uh, two different bathhouses they got one at the main one by the pool and then there's nothing uh, they actually have four campsites that's for tents and the bathhouse is across from that but uh, I might come down here and work as a camp host made my mind yet but thinking about it I say it's a really awesome place to be so I know we've enjoyed our stay here so as you can see all the beautiful spots that you get to park here I mean look at the pull through right there and then there's your table and chairs and your fire pit and stuff right here's the store laundry mat and there's a bar on the back side of it and then that's all the vegetation here on the right covers the pool. It's absolutely beautiful over there. I don't know if you can see it over there. Probably not. Driving around through here. But there's a new suites they're building on. It's gonna be a place to be, I'm thinking. But it's awesome right through here. Right there's where they rent the kayaks and stuff, boat ramp. Right there's my camper. The bridge I come over where to go. There's the boats, they ran out, pontoons and stuff. Here's the marina store. It's just awesome. Awesome place, awesome, awesome. Well, I'm just gonna give you, try to give you a few uh, spots to check out. So, welcome to the southernmost KOA right here. <laughs> we'll talk at you later.